Ricky Bradshaw's death experience still has doctors amazed. Ricky feels that it was his positive encounter in death that inspired his return to life. November 14, 1975, I was working at a grocery store in Peoria, Illinois, and I uh, was in an accident. I was a sacker there, and as I was bending over, loading the groceries in the trunk of a car, there was another car that ran into the rear end of the car I was standing behind. The car then backed off. As I fell to my knees, the car came forward again and crushed my abdomen in between the two cars. It took approximately 45 minutes for the uh, ambulance to get there, and then once they took me to the hospital, I remember going into the emergency room and then into the emergency surgery room. But shortly after that, I blacked out, and I don't remember anything else until there was a sudden flash of light uh, shortly after that, I found myself floating above my body in the operating room. I could see they were working on me. About that time, I recognized someone was standing behind me with their hands on my shoulders. He started taking me through a tunnel. There was different color lights that was going by me as if we were traveling at a high rate of speed. When we came at the end of this tunnel, I found uh, myself in a large room and there were several beings, I would say, moving about in the room. To the right of me, I saw my family and other friends who had died or people I had once known. As I stood in this room, I became aware of a great sense of uh, love and, and the wonderful good feeling that I was having also noticed that there was beautiful music coming from all around. I was taken to stand behind what appeared to be some sort of podium and I placed my hands on it. As I stood there for a, a little while, another being entered from the left-hand side of the room. He came to the center of the room and he looked at me and he says, what is your decision? At that point, everything that I'd ever done in my life or ever said, I automatically became known of it. It was, it was as if nine-tenths of my brain had just been opened up and I could remember everything. One of the things that weighed heavy on my mind at that time was how, as people came to me and, and became important in my life, many times I didn't thank them when I should have or I didn't express as much love in return when I should have. And for that uh, reason, I looked back at him and I said, I must return. Shortly after that, um, I was again taken through the tunnel and then I found myself in the intensive care room. Many people ask me if I'm, I'm frightened to die now or, um, or if when I see someone else die, if it, if it upsets me, you know. Um, personally, I, I don't have any fear of dying now. And at many times, I sometimes even wish that I could once again have that wonderful feeling that I had and to experience it again.